Hello everyone, Chris here and welcome back to Airport CEO, the Morris Bauer International Airport. Um, do you know what, I'm really really enjoying this save guys, and I'm really thankful for everyone who's been giving it a watch on a seemingly regular basis, thank you for it. I've got to say, this is probably not as popular as some of the Soviet saves, um, which, which is what we tend to do on this channel, games where we can play as the Soviet Union, but... I'm really enjoying it as a bit of a break away from that, and for those of you who've, I don't know, re religiously watched what we've done so far, I really do appreciate it, so thank you. Um, it does mean genuinely mean a lot. Where we're at then, um, a little bit off camera, the uh, jet fuel station's filled up and they're here now. We have the lorries that do it. We are now offering that service to, to vehicle, to, to aeroplanes, should they should they want it um and we'll see we'll see what happens i don't know oh look here we go here we go in fact one such vehicle is going to fill up our planes this is this is good they are our airplanes are happy with that yeah 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 they're happy they're happy cool we are researching baggage uh, baggage handling we are also currently... Oh, that just went a little bit janky. We're also... Oh, gosh. When I zoom out, my frame rate drops horrendously. Uh, we're also building a, a hangar because the tutorial has told me that that's what it wants me to do. So that's what we're doing. Um, what else is there? What else is there to do? Police are not having any luck catching the wild animals that, were, that are roaming our airport. Um, and we are also... What are we researching? I'll tell you. Uh, we are not researching shops because I forget to keep forgetting to put people on it. Um, but we are researching. I'm going to research franchise shops and baggage handling, and hopefully, that will allow us to make Moritz Bauer International Airport that just a little bit better for the customers. Um, baggage handling itself is going to be a bit of a problem because I had envisioned this area here being where we. The baggages go behind the bags go behind the scene and you can have baggage handling here. I not thought in terms of people collecting their bag or where that would be. So we're gonna have to work that one out together. It may mean that we have to go underground. I don't know. It's not something I thought through, if honest. It really isn't. Or perhaps I just make this into a big baggage room. <laughs> which would look awful, but we will have to see, won't we? The baggage baggage areas in this game are, from what I've seen, needlessly complex. So, we will find out what to do with that. But it will, it will take a bit of time. Um, we also... What else do we have to do? Are you, are you guys building this? You are. Awesome. Okay, so. Emergency response. From the runway upgrades panel, select a bill... Build a bird strike prevention. Okay, cool. Uh, we will also, while we're here, repair the runway. And we want to... 15,000! That's a lot of money. Right, okay, so if we do that... Important. Airport police cars park at the airport police station. While ambulance is in that park at the emergency response. Birds will deviate 180 degrees from the entry of a bird strike prevention's perimeter. What the, f what the flip does that mean? So should I put, should I put one like here? Where should you put the bird strike prevention? I haven't got a clue, where, you, where should you put it then? You tell me where I should be putting it. There? Oh, it spins round. Does that? So, from the build... I have built it. Oh, no, I haven't. I haven't. Sorry. No, the builders need to come and build it. Obviously. That was so, very confusing. Where are where are my builders? 
Where are you all? Oh, here's some. Coming to build this bird thing. Awesome! We've done it. We built it. Nice! Nice! So. Oh, so it's anything in that radius. We probably should put one up the other end then, shouldn't we? Is that something we should do? I know they're costly, but you'd think it would make sense to put one in there as well. Yeah, right? Money's no object for Moritz Bauer. Uh, patrols can be assigned to both security officers inside the terminal and the airport police cars. Okay. Oh, create a security officer patrol route inside the terminal. Make the patrol route four nodes or longer. Add a node by right-clicking on a terminal piece. Remove a node by left-clicking. Oh, okay, well, this is new. I like this. Um, awesome. Well, let's let's do that then. So, so security, I think you need to go here. Oh, wow. There. Oh, this is very prison architect, isn't it? Yes, we'll save that patrol. We may have to hire some more security guards, because what I want to do is um, have two. We'll have one who goes, who walks the lengths of the of here, look. We'll hire more security guards, but this is pretty cool. Oh, this is very... Pr yeah, this is very prison architect, isn't it? Assigning patrol routes. That's really cool. So we've, we'll do that. I kind of want to make a police patrol. What do you mean it's not a valid point? Shut up. Yeah, we're going to have you driving around as well. You're going on patrol, police car. Yeah, this is cool. Um, can you go like that? Yes. I don't know what it will do, whether it will do all that. Um, it's probably going to tell us we need some more security guards. And the police car has gone off on the journey. Maybe we should buy another police car. <laughs> right, let's do that. I'm, I'm all for buying new things. Order a police car. Staff. I'd like a... Oh my gosh, you're all very, you're very skilled workers. Um, who's the cheapest but good? Tanvi. Please join our workforce. So, we can delete a patrol route by choosing the X icon. Okay. And click one of its nodes. Well, no, why have you told me to do that? I don't... Oh. Okay, but I don't... That just seemed a bit pointless. I didn't want to do that. Oy, that's not nice. I'm going to have to make that route all again now. God damn it. Oh, here well, that was very kind of it. I was, was quite happy then. I'm going to make it again. Screw you, tutorial. Oh, right. Now it wants us to be an international airport. I'm not ready for that step. I'm not ready for that step. We don't have shops or anything in this airport yet. We are not. I know we are called Moritz Bar International, but we only have this this much room. So we need to expand this terminal. We need to give them more more flight options. We probably need another runway. We, there's a lot of stuff we need, and I'm not confident <laughs> that we we are ready to handle that just yet. Let's see. Um, oh, these are nearly done anyway. Once the franchise shops are done, I'm looking forward to getting that sorted. 
We'll sort some franchise shops in this episode, and then the episode after, I think we will look at baggage handling, um, because that is something I really want to do. And I really want to get some shops here. What we got here? Airline lodges. Ooh, restaurants. And the shops. Where's Moritz Bauer, do you think? Should we find him? There he is. You can see him from a mile off. Look at him. 86 he was born. That's a young age for a CEO, isn't it? So how's our economics doing? Welcome, Moritz Bauer. Thanks, guys. I'm just trying to get rid of all my notifications. I don't like them on my phone. I don't like them in the game. So... We've had a lot of flights, the airlines are gradually like, and the security is gradually getting better. But we really need to, to improve. More security guards. More everything. Stats, let's look at some stats, shall we? Aircraft stats. Which just tells us how many per minute. Our rating is slowly going up, which is good. Passenger stats, that doesn't look noticeable. Staff stats, we're using them well. I don't really understand. We need we need to sort this out. What about incidents? No incidents so far. Touch wood. But we are filling up all these things, which is great. Is there upgrades? Oh yeah, turn it to grass. I don't want to turn it to grass. I like our um, I like our asphalt fence. We got um how's how's everything going? Got a new email, economic report. Here we go, shops. Yes, which means we can research something else very quickly. So we'll do that now. Um It's gotta be franchise cafes, hasn't it? We've got the shops, we need the cafes now. But let's have a look at what we can make. So shops. Shop space, shop counter, and shelves. Oh wow. Okay. Okay, well, my initial idea was that you come in, let's put some walls up, you come into the this area here, and behind these guys, we would have some, now this isn't all going to be one shop, don't get me wrong, like, we would have a thing there. No. Oh, how big is that? <laughs> I've not even thought it through. So, yeah, we would have it there, and we would perhaps have another there. We can split them into shops. Yeah, little shops. Little shops of wonder. We can create little windows in both, in all of them. Oh, this is, this is wonderful. And then they can have little doors. Little, little, little double doors, which can go next to the windows, like so. This is, they're going to love this. Honestly, they're going to really love it. You can be a shop, you can be a shop, and you can be a shop. And then what I want is, how do you, what way around does that need to be? I'm assuming the till has to face outwards. So if I put it like that, or like that, no, 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 we'll put it to the back like like that, like that, like that, and then shelves. What are you? You are impressive, right? Um, what have we got? Pedestals, basic. Oh wow, these are these are not basic. They're, they're pretty impressive. This is who knew that having a shop would be more complicated than we thought. We'll have some wall-mounted ones on the back for you, and we'll give them all a different look. So you're wall-mounted. We'll have some nice things in the middle for you. Like so. And then what else have we got? 
nice basic wall mounted pedestal don't want that I want the pedestal yes a pedestal can go in this corner here I forgot well, should we go we'll put some more nice ones across here look just against the window for some reason okay in this one we want a large thing I don't know what this is but I want it and I want it now can't get it symmetrical much is the pain we'll have a we'll have a, a circular one here as well and then we'll have some wall mounted stuff at the back I guess can I can I see it nice no no wall mounted thank you thank you very much Um, and and then I think what happens is shops uh, come and they say that they would like your stall I guess I don't really know um, we need some more stuff in here like so let's build it we'll build it and they will if, if you build it they will come And I don't know who works at the shop. I don't know if it's our employees or the shops employ someone. But baggage handling is also completed. So that is something we can definitely look to achieve in the next episode. Um, what can we set them off on for the moment? Baggage. High speed conveyors. Baggage security. We'll do baggage security. Because that sounds like something very important. And we've got cafes coming as well. So we've got little shops here. And we could even maybe build a cafe somewhere. I've not made room for a cafe, have I? It could it maybe have to go in the middle. We may have to put the cafe here just by this gate. It's a shame. Does the cafe have to be inside? Let me just test something very quickly. It doesn't have to be Oh, okay. So it doesn't have to be walled in so we could have an open open plan cafe which would be quite nice oh we could look to sign a contract then oh wow oh wow right hang on let's let's open that in in the economy thing so offered contracts airlines what about is it in here no, loans, fees, budget. Okay, I thought it would have been in here. No, these are just the, the contract services. Available contract rating is up to a four. That's cool. Um, we have negotiation points. I didn't even know that was a thing. <laughs> okay, well, this is a shop. Is it ready? Let's, let's assign a contract to... What have we got? We've got... What the... Oh... Hello. What do paper planes do? Don't know. No one knows. Paper news. We've got power, fly go, pick and fly, the quick stop, turner, traveller shop, paper news, as to go, paper planes. Well, let's get paper news in. Paper news is your friend on all travels. We operate more than 500 newsstands and small shops that sell a big choice of newspaper, snacks and travel gadgets. And, in some stores, they even sell souvenirs. Oh, it's W.H. Smith's, isn't it? Please review the contract in detail before accepting the following conditions. At least... Oh, oh, hello, hang on. At least 182 metres at our disposal. Nine shelves and at least 255 sales per day. Right. Before I accept any of that. Before... Because I didn't even consider this. Um... Oh, right, you. We are not going to sign a contract like that. Let me reiterate that this is a cheap shop. So, if you're happy with 70 meters squared, then we're good. Let's see who'd be happy with 70 meters squared with any of them. What about quick stop? 17 meters. Yeah, you'd be happy with that. One shelf. You don't need much. 
so we need something in the middle. Not a one star, not a two star, not a th uh, four star. 73 meters for Flygo. Flipping heck. 17, we've just done you, haven't we? Turner, 15. Yeah, their requirements are bigger. Okay. Okay. Right. Maybe what we need to do. Is make a bigger shop. It's disappointing. Uh, I should have. I should have known it beforehand. This. I'm sorry. That's that's my bad. But we're gonna tear down that wall. We're gonna get rid of the till. But we are gonna put some more shelves in because they require it. Actually, we'll do it in a minute. So this shop. Um, this can be. Uh, it can't be fly go, can it? But it can be. Who should we go for? Quick. So, if you get 30 sales a day, they'll give us three grand. Three. For, well, we'll sign it with Quick Stop. Welcome, Quick Stop. It requires a member of staff, does it? What member of staff does it need? So, it's, so it is our staff. Is it a passenger assistant, do you think? What does it require? I wish it told us. What are you? Oh no, okay, no it didn't. Okay, these are these are theirs. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Well that's looking cool. Nice. So they've got their little shop. We're tearing down the wall in here. And what we'll do is, um, we will control alt and get rid of these two rooms please and then we will create one big room no we can't why can't we is it because it needs this across the way yes probably who knows but we can do that yes there we go there we go so how much square footage was that? I wish I checked. 130... 33. Great. So 133. Why are we not building it? So who requires 133? You require too much. A three star person. 140. 100... Oh my god. Oh, we've got a flight running late. Yes, please. Um, ah, there's no one in between, is there? 146. Ugh. That's annoying. That's really annoying. If I'd have just made it a little bit bigger. That's fine. We can make it a cheap shop. I'll make it a cheap shop. I am not that f I am not fussy. It's, we just wanted to see what they're like, don't we, really? Let's put some more mounted shelves up for them. And then we'll put some more down here. Oh, are you not in the shop? That's funny. Okay, that's funny. Why aren't you building this? Weirdos. Build, build me a desk. You, <laughs> you weirdo. Let's, let's delete it. And let's build it again and see what happens, shall we? Oh, I know why. No, I know why. I do. I really do. I know, I know exactly why it is. It's because it's not technically in the shop's thing isn't it yeah yes I do want to delete that and then I want to build it even bigger no will you not let me do that okay well that'll do 
how weird is this game? There, we'll put it there, and hopefully they'll build it now. I hope. Just build it. What are you doing? Why won't it build? Oh no, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, so... We have also... As I've noticed, we, the baggage conveyor things have been unlocked. Which is great, so we can create a baggage claim a area. We can create a conveyor belt. And a conveyor escalator, awesome. We can create a baggage scanner. Ooh, very nice. Must be inside the secure zone. So we could create a little secure zone in here for the baggage stuff backstage. Ooh, and well then we create use to unload and offload baggage to and from baggage trucks. Okay, we really need to have a think about where we're expanding in here then. We also, more importantly, <laughs> yes, I did say more importantly, we have a restaurant unlocked. So that's pretty cool. Right, this shop is ready for business. 140 meters. Who wants that? Come on. Who wants it? You want it. Okay, it's going to be... It's going to be Flygo, isn't it? What do you sell? Items to make you... Headphones, travel pillows, that type of thing. Yeah, you can... Flygo, welcome to the... Welcome to the airport. And eventually, here they are. Welcome to Flygo. Look at some of the stuff they sell. Books and... B bananas and... Uh, corn, apples. And ma magnets. <laughs> and magazines and... and Oh. There's a big supply of bananas in this airport. You can, if you want some, you've got them. We should change the carpet, shouldn't we, for them? What colour is Quick Stop? It's a dark blue. Yeah, we'll change the we'll change the carpets for them. We'll give them the branding they want. A fancy mat. No, no. You can have wooden floors, guys. That's cool with me. You are our our customers. Our customer. You are. Our guests in this airport, after all. Look at that. That looks great. And there's two doors into this shop, for some reason. Oh, well, it's getting late, isn't it? It's getting late at night. Perhaps this is where we'll finish here, then. We've got some shops now in Moritz Bauer International Airport. Next time round. <sighs> baggage. Baggage. Baggage in a restaurant, maybe. <laughs> Godspeed, I'll say. If you like what we've done anyway, please leave a like. Maybe consider subscribing to the channel if you like what we're doing. Um, but genuinely, thank you so much for, for watching. Um, as I say, it means the world to me. And thank you. Just thank you. <laughs> uh, see you in the next video. Have a lovely week. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye for now.